Hello everybody, this is Omni here, and today we are back on the Ripple Effect server season... I guess the official name is now season 2.5, I, I, I guess. Uh, that's what we're gonna go with. Uh, today we have v many, many very good plans, first of which, sleep. So now that that part is done, uh, I want to work a bit more on this area here, because you might have noticed that yeah, water's trickling on my face and on... I guess that's why these bed... It's also trickling on her face. It's it, it's quite uncomfortable. So I want to make this room a bit better, a bit uh, more um, fun to live in. I mean, that that's our bedroom. It's, it's quite important. Um, but, but, but... Uh, yeah, I am going to need to uh, change this staircase a bit to do that, so that that's also I'm going to need to move these items uh, somewhere else. So I'm, I'm going to try and work some on some ideas and then I'm going to start working on it. And another plan that I have for today, I'm just going to explain the plans first and then I'm going to work on them. Um, I found something pretty cool. Well, first, no, let's take a look. That's what's new here. Um, not much, not much. Uh, Kruk has been working with the villagers that I brought. And there's a zombie behind me. Let's go in quick. Um, there's another zombie there. Um, he, took, he took the villagers, he sent them somewhere else, and he brought this little guy over here who has a trade for mending. So that's pretty cool. We now have mending. I'm very happy about that. Let's throw that there. Uh, he brought the villagers just over that hill to make a little villager breeder so that we can get more and more of those little guys. So there it is. I think it's a carrot powered thing. So there's this guy who's gathering the carrots and throwing the carrots at these guys and they're they make a baby and then yeah, that's pretty much what's happening. Uh, you know the rest. Um, so that's the main thing that has changed here since the end of the last episode. Uh, by the way, this episode has not been released yet. It actually hasn't even been edited yet, but yeah, uh, that's uh, what's been happening. And the other thing that changed is over that way, I have found a little hole with a spider spawner at the bottom. So let's head down. So first I'm going to need to work on a better staircase because that's pretty painful. There it is. And spiders, die, please. Um, so yeah, that's, that's what's been happening. Sorry about that cut, I had to sneeze. I'm, I'm guessing it's the, the humidity of the bed over that way where we live. Um, so yeah, yeah, that's uh, what we have so far. So what I'm gonna work on today, I'm gonna make a spider farm. Uh, I don't have any ideas yet for what, uh, for how to build one or uh, what kind of design that I wanna have. Uh, I'll figure it out later. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna work on that and on the bedrooms over there. So I'm gonna start working on some stuff and then I'm gonna bring you back in just a few seconds. And as promised, I am back just a few seconds later and there has been some work happening around here. So first let's take a look at this. That's gonna be our dorm where we all sleep. Um, and then I'm gonna make some more stuff around here because as I said, I think someone claimed the um, the storage system project, like building a, a place to store stuff, but no one actually did it, and no one really responded when I talked about it, so I, I'm just gonna do that, and someone might be mad. It's gonna happen. I, I, I don't really mind. So I'm gonna go for, a, I think I did mention that, kind of a little, uh, like a different layers, so, or a different level. So here we have a floor here and then there's another one here. Uh, so I think it, I'm gonna pick this part here, I'm gonna make it go down 
a bit more, something like that. And I'm gonna add some stairs. I put them here. So if I go down two, two blocks here, something like that. Uh, and then, uh, because, uh, sorry about that, I was kind of uh, lost in my thoughts. Uh, but the issue here is that we're headed into the ocean if we were going that way. So, um, yeah, it's uh, it's something to take care of. And also there is sand, and I'm pretty sure that there's water right above this. I'm going to flood the whole place. Oh, I was wrong. But I'm pretty sure that if I remove this sand column, uh, I'm going to get some more water. There we go. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to replace the sand later. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of the idea that I'm, I'm going for. Did I say that that I am I'm go? Anyway, I'm, I'm confused. Sorry. Um, so yeah, that, that's the idea for this place. Different little layers here. And here I'm also going to have a little staircase that might lead down. I think I'm going to change it so that it goes that way instead. So from here, although this one is on that side, I don't want to have it be symmetrical. So I'm not sure. Oh, maybe we could have another floor here, like a little room here. So it could go on the side of that floor there, but it's going to be parallel to anyway. Uh, so many things to consider even though they're they're not really that important um but yeah i'm, I'm gonna dig out some more stuff uh put in for example all of our furnaces and uh, all that stuff all of our smeltery stuff uh it used to be in the middle of the place and then i put it right where i decided to build this staircase uh, and also this staircase here connects to the uh, the one that was already here and I, th I also thought I'd mention, uh, I'm not going to keep it all cobble. I started adding uh, some more blocks, but uh, I'm, I'm not sure exactly for the visual design of the thing, of this whole area, but so far it's going to be stone blocks, like stony blocks, uh, and the side polished and the side cobble with oak fences. I, th I think it looks good. I, I like the way it looks. I like it. Um, so let's just put that here for the moment. There we go. Uh, and the stone cutter is going to go here. Um, uh, but 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 in the meantime, also, yes, YD asked if any of us had any big holes to dig because she needs a lot of stone. Uh, so she dug out the whole area around the um, the, the 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 spider farm the spider spawner where i'm gonna build the spider farm so that's what i'm gonna go and work on right now it's over here uh, so let's go down and take a look although i kind of forgot it takes like half an hour going down there it's really really deeper than i thought oh and there it is awesome um very cool a big 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 hole she didn't even take the iron we're not that rich yet, uh, so I'm gonna go around and take some iron, and I'm gonna find a, some way to uh, make a spider farm. The way I'm thinking of using is maybe having, uh, you, you can tell me if it's something that works or not, uh, but having kind of uh, water that flows down, stay that, like on, on the walls or maybe on the ceiling, flows down be, uh, to, uh, to make sure that the spiders don't... Uh, climb up on the walls so maybe something like that could be a good idea and it could look cool as well if i if i manage to make it look cool uh, plus it they could all um, rejoin together and have a like uh, make a water flow thing that leads all the spiders in the right place where i want them to be that was poorly phrased but you get what i mean i hope uh, so I'm I'm gonna start working on that now. I'm gonna leave because they're just starting to spawn, and I don't want to deal with them right now. But yeah, again, few seconds, it will be done. And we are back, and the funnel of the farm has been built, and here it is. So the the spider spawned somewhere around there. 
they fall in the water, they get sent in the middle here. And so far, that's all that's happening. Uh, I kind of sort of realized that they can swim against the current, even like climb walls against the current, which I thought they could not, but apparently they can. So it kind of ruined the idea of having all those water streams falling down, but I think it looks cool. So I'm going to keep it like that. Uh, next step is going to be to put some glass over here because, well, there is none, so I could fall in, which would be a very bad thing. Um, and downstairs, down here, um, we're still here in range uh, with the spawner here, so we can still activate it. And uh, we can kill the spiders here manually. Let me just put my, my pickaxe in my offhand to repair it with the XP that I will gather. Uh, so it's still very, very far from ideal. Sorry about that emergency cough. Uh, it's still far from ideal, but I could not record uh, a lot lately. So I had to make it at least usable by the other uh, member of... Oh, that's my armor. Oops. Uh, by, by the other swamp dwellers here. Uh, so yeah, it works, it's usable. Now, next part that I'm going to make is a little uh, way to uh, move them around, move the spiders around. Um, because I, I can't just have it here. They, I, I want them to be all in the same spot. That's kind of the best way to go. Uh, so I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to bring you back. Why did I go in? That was dumb. Also, my pick is full, so I don't need to kill any more spiders. You know how that works. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to go and do some stuff, and then I'm going to be back. And it is done. Let's go take a look at this by jumping inside this hole here. So I made this easy access and this easy way out to get to the farm and away from the farm, depending on your needs at the moment of the... You, you, you know what I'm... I'm not trying to say anything that makes sense. I'm sorry about that. Ow! Uh, so yeah, they kind of appear here, and then they look at you, and they show you their butt, so you can hit them in the butt with your sword, and kill them, and gather all that sweet, sweet XP. Um, so that's pretty much it. You can also access the inside of the farm if you break these blocks here, and you... Well, there's nothing to see here. There's no reason to come here, so... Let's pretend I did not just do that. <clears throat> and when you get out, you end up here. Uh, there is nothing at all that shows that the farm is here, so I'm going to build something a bit later, but I'm totally uninspired for, uh, you, you know, to, what to build here. Uh, so, uh, yeah, it's it, right now it's just two holes. That's, that's what we're going to have to deal with for the moment. Also, I have this little thing running for no reason at all. Same reason I have shears on my hotbar. Uh, it's I'm just trying to collect some some uh, of those things. How do you call those? I forgot their name. Vines, of course. Yes, I I just need to gather some vines to do some stuff that you will see right away. <clears throat> Sorry about that, there's just some disgusting stuff in my throat. Um, I worked a bit more on the downstairs area. I have no idea how it looked the last time that you were here, but that's what it looks like right now. And so yeah, that's the reason why I need some vines. I want to have some mossy cobblestone to add just a little bit more variation in color in here. I'm also going to add some uh, andesite stuff as well. But yeah, so far that's what it looks like. Here we have, well, here we have the, the bedroom, the dorm, but I think you saw that already. And here we have a uh, fuel chest and a smeltables chest. So, uh, well, minecart chest. Uh, so if we press on that button, it sends the minecart and it goes through uh, the smelting system that I have put here uh, with a little lever here that will lock the hoppers underneath uh, to allow you to gather the stuff and get the XP yourself or if you, you're just lazy and you don't want to get the XP just put it on automatic and you'll get the XP later. Uh, 
you know how that works. That that's not really important. Uh, but yeah, here we have this little platform here. So I'm I'm as I said, I have no idea what you saw and what you didn't see yet. So so far, that's kind of what I'm going with. Some little platforms here and there. Um, uh, I'm gonna have like another little balcony here. It's just gonna be a little. Like we're gonna have access to uh, the, the 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 smelted stuff somewhere on this wall here, um, and then there's gonna be another balcony looking down, down there, and it's gonna connect with the storage. Well, not connect, but it's gonna lead to a storage system, storage area. Uh, sadly, I can't just expand that way because you you kind of see the little drips, little water drips here and there. But yeah, it's uh. It's, it, it leads into the lake right next to our house uh, so, and yeah we don't really have any room at all to uh, work with oh, I'm gonna need that luck also I'm gonna need to breathe some air uh, but I could just move a bit more like that way uh, underground so I would have more room in any case, I'm gonna need to uh, go down further. Well, go yeah, further down. So I'm gonna have some more balconies and stuff like that. Uh, plus, I'm gonna be able to connect eventually them with the uh, connect them eventually. Order in your words, please, Omni. Uh, connect the little uh, storage area that I want that I want to build with this staircase here. So maybe there could just be like a fork, and it, it leads to you can gain access on the side here, something like that. Uh, to have, uh, to, to, to go to the storage area that I keep talking about. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the plans for this place here. So I'm gonna work on that, not in the episodes, uh, or well, between the, this episode and the next episode, because that's all the time that I have to record for today. I am sorry if it, it, it makes you sad, it, it's not what I want, but that's how life is. Um, so I hope you enjoyed, if you did press a button or another, they all do the same for me. Thank you for watching and bye bye!